Okay, the second thing is you have to choose a right asset pack. How you can understand which asset pack going to be work with your one? So for here, I'm demonstrating three asset pack. I'm not promoting those things. It's literally sucks. I, I really don't like to promote any party stuff because you know, uh, it might be problem for you. You maybe don't like my stuff that I'm going to like. So that's why. So for only demonstrate purpose, I'm showing these three stuff. You guys, I'm again saying you don't have to do anything with those asset pack. Okay. So this is one of his, the stylized wallet for us. Second one is more like the realistic version. And the third one is the mobile variant. Now what is the difference between the three things? The first thing, once you like anything, just scroll down to the, their technical form. Guys, this is the one of the important thing you should check once you like the asset pen and before buying any asset pen. So let me show you what is the difference in this asset three pack. First, just look the quality. It's look more like stylized and it's pretty look good quality environment. Okay, it's a tropical forest one, which is a really it's also a great asset pack. And then you can see the technical stuff. And lastly, we have this thing. Uh, it's more like give you three landscapes and the materials and you can see both are all of the other asset pack will give you same. Now the main thing in their technical details. Why? Look, the first thing we have to check which asset pack has using less and less uh like you know what you can say more or less like the triangles or polycaps. Okay, that is the important actually. The second thing we have to check how much the number of the materials and material instance, how much their material are label and ATC. And lastly, we have to check their compatible platform and engine as well. Now, because we are using Unreal Engine 5 series, the, all the asset pack are supporting the latest engine version. This no asset pack doesn't support, however, but still you can use any asset pack from 5.4 to any upgraded version. Okay. Now here in this pack, this stylized one have vertices count 9 to 1 lakh 30,000. Okay. Oh, sorry. It's a uh, 13,000 and 46 triangles. Okay. Which is pretty good. 13 to 50,000 triangles is pretty good for the mobile. Is it has LOD? Yup, it has. Guys, LOD is really important for mobile games. So we have to keep it in mind. About the materials, you can see it's just have 5 materials and material instance is 50. Number of texture is 7 which is quite enough optimized because number of texture is also important because it's really uh, affecting the draw calls. Okay, now in the supporting the platform, this is for the basically the editor support. So it support both window and Mac. Uh, they didn't specify anything for the Linux. Okay, so sorry for the Linux user. Okay, now in the uh, supported target platform this is also important uh, by default uh, the developers has tried to upload their asset pack like which platform there is asset pack going to be support so this developer said it's going to be support for windows and mac so he doesn't say about android or ios so you can't blame him in later after the purchasing hey your asset is not working properly or it doesn't give you the quality that i expected okay okay now go to the tropical jungle pack and you can see this one, they already said what they are giving, number of meshes, collisions, LOD, yes, but they also include with the billboards which is much better, okay, the number of instance 100, number of texture 200 which is uh, loss of, but according to this one, uh, I think it have loss of uh, mat more material, okay, and about the texture resolution which is quite enough good, and also you can see the windows man okay but he doesn't test it so this one is more actually uh, what i can say uh like more specified he did more specified thing so which is really good and about the compatibility and the support platform this is one of the best thing that oculus and gear vr look we all know the oculus and the vr set is really not powerful rather than the mobile set it's more poor so if any asset pack saying that it's supporting oculus so this is really good asset pack you can literally try okay but yeah more like it's also depends on their polygons and but look these ones have less vertices which is really affect a lot this one at 30,000 this one have only 5,600 which is oh is it so yeah it is it is so 5,600 that's pretty good and the third one this is the mobile they already said this is a mobile train now you can literally see the quality difference you are might be expecting from 
this level quality but you are reaching this which is really poor but you can't do because look the mobile is not like the your, your mobile app doesn't have the rtx and CTK, gpu and cpu okay so however uh you can still have it for high-end device and at here you can see the poly counts is under only 1k vertices uh realistic number of matches 21 lod yes it's have lod materials and you can see it's just have 22 textures really and 1k and 2k standard and it's already said it's upon Android and iOS. So you can literally, if you're thinking, or if you think that bro, I can't take the headache of optimization, you can literally purchase this asset pack, this kind of like asset pack, and you can go with those, okay? But if you are looking for, no brother, I can't really, you know, I can't really, I, ca I can do optimization, you then can go with this one, the Tropical Jungle Pack and the, this one. So in my case, I'm going to, to go with this one because Whichever asset pack I'm going to use this uh, project, it's not going to be support for PC. Okay, it's all, uh, it's not, uh, sorry, for the mobile, all are going to be used for the PC. So I like to use the PC asset for the mobile. So let's go and let's see how it's going.